So here we have this view and here we have some different holes. Some holes are the same. But now we want to specify in the table how many holes do we have and what are the dimensions and locations of those holes. And for that we're going to use hole table. So let's go to annotation tab. Let's go to tables here. And here we have a whole table. So here you can define table template. Here you can choose alphanumerical control. We're going to show that later. And let's go down here to datum. First, we have to choose origin because relative to those origin, we can define the locations of the holes. So we can choose, for example, this circle here. And now here we have our origin X and Y. And down here we have to define holes. Now we can go here and we can click on each hole. Or we can just click on this face here, like this. And now all holes are selected. And now we can just click OK. And this is our table. Let's put this table here. So here we have tag number A1, A2, A3, location X and Y. And here we have the size. So those three, A1, A2, A3, have the same size as well. B1 to B4, C1 to C2. D1 to G3 have the same size. And here we can see which one is A1, B1, C1, and so on. Now let's click on this table here. And let's go here. And here we have some options. We can go combine same sizes. So let's check this one. And now we can see this is more clear. So those have the same sizes as well, those one and so on. Also, we can go combine same text like this. Now we have A, B, C, D, and E. Here we have the size and quantity, but we don't have locations. Now let's go here to alphanumerical control. Now we have A, B, C, D, and E. We can start, for example, from C. And now we have C, D, E, F, G. As well, we can go here to numbers. We can start at 1, or we can go and we can start, for example, at 5. Like this. But let's go to A, B, and C. And let's start with A. Like this. And let's go down here and let's uncheck combine same text. Like this. And let's go with combine same sizes. And let's click OK. So this is how you can create a simple whole table for hosts. If you're tired of watching YouTube videos and buying cheap courses, who always leave you wishing and wanting for more, and you want to have personal support to learn the SOLIDWORKS from the absolute zero to the professional level to improve and start your career, check the link below and visit our Super SOLIDWORKS Accelerator Academy. As well, if you like this video, click like and subscribe.